Well, now to a deadly rampage in front of the Santa Monica courthouse. A driver mows down a man tonight and just kept going until he crashed on Main Street. Horrifying scene playing out the Superior Court building between Pico and Olympic. KCOD9's Tom Waite is there live with more of the story. Tom? And Jeff, that victim was paying for parking at the kiosk just behind me under those carports. That driver hit him while he was paying for parking. Then that driver kept going. He slammed into that Corvette across the street just in front of the Rand Corporation. Police say the driver of the gray Camry at the center of your screen killed a man paying for parking here at the Santa Monica Courthouse. Investigators say he came off of the 4th Street entrance on one side of the courthouse, plowed through the parking gate, then slammed into the victim, sending him into the air. He would die of his injuries. The driver kept going onto Main Street. He hit a parked Corvette before coming to a stop and then taking off on foot. Stunned witnesses could barely believe what they saw. Officers who were in the area were flagged down by several witnesses, and shortly after that, officers gave chase of the, of the suspect and took him into custody at 3rd Street and Pico. The suspect is described as a man in his 20s. Why he carried out this deadly and terrifying crash is unclear. Police don't know if the suspect knew the victim, who is a man in his 40s. What is clear, the suspect must have been going blazing fast because he sheared off protective guard posts and crushed trash cans before he came to a stop. Police say so many other people could have been hurt or worse. It's very busy, as we know, during certain times of the day. And when this occurred at about 3.30, that's a pretty busy time of day. Santa Monica police say there may have been alcohol involved, but the motive is the big question. And tonight on our sister station, CBS 2 News at 11, we've just received a booking photo of the suspect, that driver from police. We'll show that to you and have more information about his background. We're live tonight in Santa Monica. Back to you in the studio.